So we're looking at the communes of Bordeaux today and with this wine we're looking at Saint-Julien. Saint-Julien is on the left bank of Bordeaux. Um, the left bank of the river is high in gravel content and it suits Cabernet Sauvignon better, which means the majority of wines that come from the left bank are dominant in, in Cabernet Sauvignon. Um, they will have smaller proportions of Merlot, Petit Verdot, Carmenere, Cabernet Franc, um, and also Malbec is allowed, but very little is used nowadays in Bordeaux. Um, so Saint-Julien nestles itself between uh, Poyac and Margot, and in style it's said to be very much of a sort of intermediary between the two. Um, it doesn't have the power and richness of Poyac, or quite the finesse and fragrance of Margot, but is a lovely sort of middle of the road, very straight, age-worthy, beautifully tailored red wine. Um, let's smell this and see if we get some evocative notes of uh, Saint-Julien. Mm, we get a bit of cedar, a little bit of cassis, that black fruit from the Cabernet Sauvignon. This is the reserve of Vilbarton, which means it's the second wine. And that means that basically they're using the uh, younger vines um, or lesser fruit from sort of different vineyards that might not be seen as good enough for the Grand Vin. This means that we can afford um, to buy this wine uh, because the pricing is much more accessible for a second wine. They also mature more quickly. So this is 2014 vintage. If you were buying a Grand Vin, you wouldn't be drinking this yet. It wouldn't be so open and evocative. Um, but for us today, this is, I think, drinking beautifully. Um, let's taste it. Mm. That's lovely. You have that lovely finesse that the Barton family managed to hold in all of their chateau. They just managed the tannins beautifully. It has a really grainy texture. Um, Leoville Barton is still run by Lillian Sartorius Barton uh, and her two children, Damien and uh, Melanie, are becoming far more involved in the working. Melanie actually makes the wine at Maubazan Barton. Um, they have their Irish roots and are very proud of them and I think that's why Leoville Barton is so popular in Ireland. But I hope you've got a good meal to have this with this evening or today and uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in.